earlier today in the Rachel Maddow Show offices before I'd put any sort of product in my hair whatsoever. Okay, Ken. So yeah. just confirm for me. Just, I mean, mm -hmm. we asked George W. Bush for an interview like, like, like a news show, like normal people do, but we're not getting it. Yeah, right. That's not going to happen. You think this Facebook thing might really work? We won't know unless we try. Right? I mean, ultimately, he's the decider, though. He's never going to pick us. Uh, the Facebook people are actually going to decide the first round. Of oh. This. So, I mean, you should try it. Well, we... Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. We, got, I mean, we have good questions. You put this on the blog yesterday, and people have given us good suggested questions. Do, uh -huh. you, do you feel like we should just, like, test run them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Right. Go ahead. Uh, can, can you... Should I tell... Can you please define compassionate conservative and explain how exactly your policies as president displayed these ideals? Huh? That, that, that's good. I think that that's would be a really good first good. one, because I bet he really wants to talk Yeah, about I like that. Okay. Um, do you think that Sarah Palin uh, has the skills, experience, and qualifications necessary to be president of the United States of America? I think it's a good mm. question, but I totally know what he's going to say. Yeah, everyone wants to know that, though. Yeah, but he's just going to, I mean, what's he going to say, no? <laughs> <laughs> um, have you successfully eaten a pretzel in the last eight years? <laughs> I want to know that one first. I know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that one definitely has to be towards the end. Right. Um, this one, I actually, I am. This is the one that I am most legitimately curious about. Okay. We have heard you pronounce the word N U C L E A R um, n as nuclear right. before, but most of the time you chose to say it nuclear. Nuclear. Why choose to say it more often like that? Uh -huh. I honestly want to know. Yeah, right. Me too. Um, is it true that Cheney protected himself by embedding his entire torso with gems and gold? That's what I want to know. That's, I hear that every that day. <laughs> every day. All right. Are we still taking more suggestions on the blog? Absolutely, yeah. All right. Deadline's tomorrow. We can do this, right? Can we? I really want to. We're going to get this. Thank you. We're going to get this. <laughs> Come on. All right. This is a real thing. This is how it works. President Bush is hosting a contest on Facebook. The winner of the contest gets to fly to Texas to interview him. To enter, we have to submit five questions for him in the comment section of his Facebook page before 5 p.m. Central Time tomorrow. They pick 100 finalists who get to submit a two-minute video. Then the top five videos, how do they pick the top five? Get posted on his Facebook wall. Facebook users then get to vote for the winner, and the winner gets round-trip airfare to Dallas to go interview President George W. Bush, which is definitely the only way I will ever get to interview George W. Bush. Okay, so we are starting with, is it true that Dick Cheney protected himself by embedding his entire torso with gems and gold? We're starting with that. If you have other suggested questions you would like to help us out with so we can win this contest, please help us. Mattoblog.msnbc.com before 1 p.m. Eastern tomorrow if you can. I want to win this so bad. Please help us.